Jai, le roi Kodash.
he was preaching and saying now um, there's power in the name of jc right and same time a man started to take him with a heart attack right and the pastor now was the most frightened person in the <laughs> church right now if there was power in the name of jc he would have to heal him and heal him but he was the most frightened person in the church like he didn't want to and approach him man. You understand? And that just shows you that these pastors and them is just a game kind of game thing with them. Hey, mm-hmm. like, like our camp leader, like my good brother Marcus, he just said sometime when he was in the world with the church. He said everybody else catching the Holy Spirit, but he wants to know about it now. Well, everybody falling on, but he wants to know well, what's going on. I have so much demons on me. <laughs> you understand? But it has some pastors that actually put their lady hands on the head according to the scripture lay their hands on the head and they will actually force you down yeah. it's like Dan, Dan they're trying to throw me down what's going on with you? I know mommy ain't feeling nothing take your time it's so I like lying you understand go ahead right because as the brother said the pastor is forcing forcing the Put a hand on you to make you fall long that it's a show the congregation that some kind of power on them. Yeah. They don't want to look good. Can. You understand? I actually hear I actually heard of instances where right from certain people in the past actually was by people who fall long. Oh, oh. You know, just follow the show. I used to tell them bullshit these pastors are. Alright? That is why the name of the scripture say, hey, I uh, because certain things will actually seem spiritual, because as I say. Certain instances they will actually have unclean spirits, but this is not where the most high because the name of the most high in Jesus, so it can never cast out a demon really actually in the name of Jesus. The true name of the Father is Yahweh, and his son name is Yahusha, and his name we always exalt and extol until the day of death, hopefully, so Yahweh Shem El Shariat is up. You understand? But that's why the name of this video is A, and be a lion spirit in the mouth of these dear prophets. You understand? But Right, so oh, all right verse seven for unclean spirits crying with loud voice came out of many that were possessed with them and many taken with palsies and that were lame were healed with it and there was great joy in that city but there was a certain man called Simeon, which before time in the same city used sorcery and bewitched the people of Samaria, giving out that himself was some great one. Yeah, so this 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 particular guy named Simeon used sorcery, all right, to bewitch the people, meaning what had them in a trance or had them in a docile state of mind feeling that what he was some great person that he was some some person came from the heavens that he was some person came from God that his blessings and all these kind of things came from from uh it came from the most high upon him so that thing that taught the blessings that the most high was upon this guy all right and going on will, will actually prove that people use sorcery to make them feel like there's a man of God well we stand to whom they all gave heed from the least to the greatest. Yes, so everybody t- listen to him. You understand? To, from the smallest to the greatest. Where, where, where? Hey, nah, that that person is a man of God. They don't even have to read the Bible. They, they, hey, me, I don't have to. But pastor say, and pastor say, and pastor say this, but no pastor say that. But pastor, what? He 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 read people in the name of Jesus. Hey, um, yeah, 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 so, oh, I'm gonna get out of this. Yeah, come on, I'm gonna get out of this. Good, go ahead, Adam. Read the next case, please. Yeah, you go. Read it on. To whom they all gave heed from the least to the greatest, mm-hmm. saying, This man is the great power of your house. Read it over. That this Verse man. 10. To whom they all gave heed. From the least to the greatest, saying, This man is the great power of Yahweh. That this man is the great power of Yahweh. This man is the great power of God. You understand? So this man used sorcery and actually, like, he came in the name of the Mosai. Yeah. So, hey, I was watching, um, wait, this 
to be touched over the cases. All right, a, a church here in Trinidad up in Arima, where he, he so called was casting out a demon. Uh, I think the demon name was Hanuman or something so. You understand a deity from um, Elam or the Indians, right? And he was talking to the demon. Now, I don't know any prophet or any um, apostle in the Bible ever asked any demon, Do you like me? Now, he goes, Do you like me? Do you like me? That is why he asked the demon. The demon say, No. Why? Why you don't like me? Because it's a man of God. Because it's a man of God. Sound familiar? Read over that part. Verse 10. To whom they all believe, from the least to the greatest, say, Read over them. Huh? Read over them as they say. Go ahead. This man is the great power of God. That is the great power of God. So a lot of people are like, yes, yes, Dr. L. L. Spencer is a man of God, casting out demons in the name of Jesus. But hey, what was what was the son of God name 2,000 years ago? Acts 4 verse 12 said, no other name. Meaning what? There's only one name. One name. Where, where, where? Sir, go ahead. Hey, hey. And he was, you know, he was catching the royal backside to actually take all these demons. The scripture say in um, the book of John, when Legion saw him, uh, Legion get frightened and he came out one time. When when the, when the apostles um, cast out demons, it's one time. Uh. When I watch his exorcist movie, um, in the name of Jesus, and thing, and they are the cross, they are the holy water, they are garlic, they are the... the, the, the wizard, wizard. Wizard. Yeah. With all of that, as the brother, with all of that, and he did. Jesus. <laughs> it's to show him mockery. That name is filth. That's right, Amage. Yahweh by Shami Shai is his name, by. That's right. Hey, I had a dream, Salakia. No mean to really go into dream, but I had a dream where, where I was going through something. And demons was coming, and as I mentioned that name, demons step back with fear. You see the fear on your face. And I say, hey, matter of fact, in the name of Yahweh Hashem, I get out of here, they ride out. You feel like fight up? I didn't fight up. Hey, I get hold on in that dream already. I use that name and it ride out. So, yeah, likewise. Yeah, go ahead. Well, as the brother saying that he get hold on, that night I was home. Knowing myself, everything normal, and just so this this demon come upon me and hold me down, and it's like all my strength wasn't there. I was weak, and all I saying is, in the name of our Basham, I was shy. You had a flee. Let our no name stronger than the name of our Basham, I was shy, and the demon did flee. The demon did flee. Understand? How much times? Because, hey, I speak from experience, experience means child. How much time do Christians, when, when, when it is a pray? All right, and I just something to catch all it to, um, something hold it on. Because just when I like something that, especially in the Caribbean, that's something to Something hold it on. And how much time you have to say in the name of Jesus? In the name of, how much times you have to say that? You have to say that multiple times, boy. But at once, at once, these demons flee from me in the name of Yahweh, Shemeh, Shemeh, Right. You know, hey, and the scriptures go and prove it. The scriptures go and prove it. Alright? The scriptures say the whole things. So, I'll just bear with us one second. Um right. I just show you that. Basically, these pastors just aren't funny. It's all about filling the pockets. You understand? Because when you watch them casting out so called demons, it's just for a show. Right? They're just showing that they don't funny. Right? Yeah. Two. They make no sense what they're doing. This is um, our precept here. James chapter 2 verse 19 it says thou believest that there is one power thou doest well 
the devils also believe and tremble. Yeah, the deceivers and the demons or the, the evil angels also believe and they tremble. Look how much times they make mockery at our name. Hey, it's our time, I think it's in Tel Aviv, self in Jerusalem. Or if not Tel Aviv in Jerusalem, somewhere in America, they also have that game to read. And they actually had two men just up as Jesus, right? And what they said was um, because they actually have an illustration on it on Facebook too. Jesus fucking Christ. So they had Jesus and Jesus, one bent over, and the next one with the rod up inside the next one, Jesus fucking Christ. You think the most I'm gonna make mockery in him, mate? Right. The fact that he said this. Right. But let's say this. And I was about the age of 22, 23. We were all talking about them um, spirits holding you down in the rest when they're sleeping at night. Yeah. Was that thing used to go with me. It was it was unbearable. You know? And calling the name of Jesus wasn't helping. Hmm. Hmm. You know? Calling the name of Jesus wasn't helping at all. And I was sleeping in my own room. And every time that thing and I fight and I fight and I fight. I don't know how long I used to be fighting for. But it was a long period of time because well, my, I, was, I grew up as a Christian. I grew up as a Christian, a Seventh day Adventist. Hmm. Oh, beyond the them. <laughs> and God, God. my mother used to come in the room now and chant and pray and thing and laugh and she sings the song, pray and thing, read Psalms and wherever and wherever. And I go back and see if I was getting home long again and again. And I, it, was, it was no rest for me. There is no fear. You know, until I didn't want to, I didn't want to sleep when the night come. Hmm. So the name of Jesus has no power. That's right. That's right. There's no power in that name. Can't. Fuck Jesus. Shit. There's no power in that name, boy. This is um, Jeremiah 23, verse 26 and 27. How long shall this be in the heart of the prophets that prophesy lies? Hmm. Yea, they are prophets of the de of deceit of their own hearts, which seem to cause my people to forget my name by their dreams, which they tell every man to his neighbor, as their fathers have forgotten my name for Baal. Alright, because what does actually go on in some of these churches? They say, um, a dream or a sea. Alright? They're the same dreams. Right? A vision dream basically around the same thing. I see that um, this one choke powder by a door, oil and powder. Now I had the soul and foot. But in the name of Jesus, you you cause any people to forget the name of Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai, Shai for the name of Jesus, which is Baal. Because Baal just means um Lord, husband, or master. Baal ain't a bad word. So when when you go into it, a lot of women out here they like to call Jesus. That's my husband. I save myself for Jesus. Or yeah. hey, the scripture has said. You, you know how the scripture has cut on you. Yeah? Um, Philippians. Every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that Jesus is Lord. That is telling that Jesus is Baal. But the true interpretation was supposed to be every knee shall bow, every tongue shall confess that Yahweh Baal shall Um, um, Haya. Other one, which meaning he's the Lord, he's the breadwinner. That's right. You understand? But hey, Jesus is all the Lord, he's all the Baal. All the worship Baal. That is why um, Elijah the prophet had to cut up 400 of his, um, his prophets. That's something here for you. Right. This is Psalm 78, as I not lose 10. It says, They keep not my covenant of. If, Salah. They keep not the covenant of power. And refuse to walk in his law. Yes, yeah, so you people refuse the agreement because covenant goes back to agreement. You people um, refuse the agreement that the most I had with the agreement to keep his law, statutes, and commandments. That's right. Not to worship all of the, um, these, these idols. Most I said, I is the one who bring out all of Egypt. Don't serve these other gods because I jealous, I a consuming fire, mm -hmm. burn all over you. You understand? So the most is the one who went and destroy all of you. Hey, you said something earlier on about the sore foot. Now, you don't see the, well, actually, I can't say the Christian, but the Baptist and them has more had his sore foot, right? But 
Why well, saying this saw foot? Where did this come from? Because I don't see with all the, the, the hocus pocus these backs and the Jews. How they still get so foot? The scriptures say, um, um, how good? I think it's Psalms 125. Mm. We say, um, if the the, the the right, if the right just put his hand in iniquity, um, let's for you guys. How you go? Psalm 125. Which one? Yes. Which one? Which one? Yes, it's it's Psalms 125 verse 3. Right. For the rod of the wicked shall not rest upon the lot of the righteous, lest the righteous put forth their hand unto iniquity. Yeah, and that's how they gave them so foot because they was doing wickedness. That's right. As the brother was saying earlier, it's wickedness that they was doing because the, the, the British scripture said the wish of sin is death, death. but the gift of the most is eternal life. Do good. And, 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 and we'll follow you. Right? So, hey, first Kings 22 and 19, Ezekiel 14 and 19. Right? Because you people trust in your pastors. But because I wickedness, the most I use these pastors to deceive all you. Ezekiel And the, um, the, this first Kings 22 verse 19, or start of verse 18, it says, And the king of Israel said unto Job, O Sophat, did I not tell thee? that I would prophesy no good concerning me, but evil. God, so this is Micaiah, right? Speaking to the two kings, because they actually went to war. Hey, you know that little input I will put? It's at a time Judah, Israel, and Edom went to war with the, um, went to war together. That is to show wicked all the fucking white people, listen. Because Israel helped all the numerous times in history with all the wars and them kind of thing and all they still planning to fuck up Israel because mm. Jehoshaphat went to war with all it he went to war with Ahab he went to war with Ahab um Ahab so which I think was Ahaziah right if it was Ahaziah was his next son uh, with, with the king of Edom against the Syrians mm. he also went to war with all it uh, against the Romans all the Greeks stab us in our back and then we went to war with all the Romans which was white people again against the Greeks we helped all in all the kingdom and all the still want to kill Israel the scripture says all the, all, the, all the thing with the brotherly covenant all the wicked bastards Yahweh Hashem and Hashem destroy all the might can, can, can we have a law a matter of fact we have a law with Moses and we have a concern with Amalek can Exodus 7 and 14 and 8 can because they break all the ordinances. They, they keep no, they keep, these people keep no promises, no um. There's, there's not men of the word? No, there's not men of the word. This is Exodus 17 verse 14. And Yahweh said unto Moses, Write this for a memorial in the book, and rehearse it in the ears of Joshua. For I will utterly put out the remembrance of Amalek from under heaven. What? God, yeah, Moses actually Amalek, because why? I think Amalek actually goes back into a warlike people or violent people. So the most I gonna put all your out, out, um, put all your name out of the, on the earth, by you understand? But anyway, go back there, go back on track. Go back on track. Um, this um, verse 19, 2 Kings chapter 22, verse 19, it says, And he said, Hear thou therefore the word of your house. I saw Yahweh sitting on his throne and all the hosts of heaven standing by him on his right and on his left. And Yahweh said, Who shall persuade Ahab that he may go up and fall at Ramoth Gilead? Right, and I believe the Hebrew word there is Mawat. 
that you may one die at the Ram of Gilead. So the Mosai wanted Ahab to die for what his wicked deeds. Gone. All right, go ahead. And one said on this man, and another said on that man. And there came forth a spirit and stood before Yahweh and said, I will persuade him. Mm -hmm. And Yahweh said unto him, so, this, so that this most likely was a 